All right, hello everyone, and welcome back to my Fallout 4 Mod Spotlight series, where today we are having a look at the tacky holiday sweaters of the Commonwealth mod, which is being made by user Bitter Wanderer. And what this festive little piece of work is looking to add into the game is a series of six different tacky holiday sweaters, each with three different style variations. And of course, you can't have Christmas without a Santa hat. And I, oh, I love this mod. And I I figured, hey, what the heck, we are a couple of days out from Christmas, we might as well have a look at a holiday-themed mod, and this one piqued my interest because, well, I'll be honest with you guys, I'm a fan, in real life, of the tacky holiday sweaters. So this made me laugh, and here we are. So once you do have this installed, how do you get your hands on one of these glorious holiday sweaters? Well, much like with many other mods out there, you go to the chemistry station, where you will build these in a new newly created category called Holiday Sweaters. In here you will find all six different sweaters with their three style variations. So the style variations are the same for each sweater. So we have the sweater with uh, slack pants, sweater with jeans, and finally a sweater vest. So those are the three style variations. Now as for the sweaters themselves, we have the festive not Santa sweater, the festive fruitcake sweater, the festive get blitzed sweater and we of course then have the holiday hat here a festive jolly radstag sweater which <laughs> i admit i think is my favorite one and i actually want one of these in real life that'd be wonderful then the mistletoe sweater and finally a festive tree sweater and you'll notice each one of these it only requires a mere two cloth to be created, which is pretty impressive. You're not going to need much to make these, and normally I'd kind of, you know, bitch a little bit about, oh, it doesn't seem, you know, balanced, but you know what? It's, it's the holidays. Have a little fun. Spend a mere two cloth to make a lovely sweater that also gives you to charisma as hey I mean it's the holiday season who doesn't like someone wearing a festive sweater you're gonna up that charisma real nice now once you have these built what's even more amusing is you can actually go to an armor workbench and every one of these sweaters and including the holiday hat which I forgot to mention does also give you one perception and one charisma each one of these can be upgraded with Ballistic Weave, so you can actually become a pretty tough holiday sweater wearing wanderer. And that, uh, that amuses me greatly, that you can add up to Mark V Ballistic Weave on the Santa hat and any one of these various festive sweaters. That's just, oh, it makes me happier than you can imagine. And on top of it all, of course, I am still wearing my standard armor right now that we've been wearing in the series. And if I go to put on one of these sweaters, you'll notice that if we put on the Not Santa sweater, only my chest piece disappears. That's right, folks. You can still, besides adding uh, <laughs> the ballistic weave to these, you can still wear your arm and leg armor pieces so that you can have even more extra protection. And that is just wonderful. Now let's actually pop on the holiday hat rather than our helmet and take a look at the Not Santa. There we go. We have the I, I'm Not Santa on there with, uh, ooh, but you can still still sit on my lap. There we are. That's what's written in red. Kind of hard to see. And on the back, it says, of course, ho, ho, ho. Good times. Now, let's actually take off our arm pieces so we can see these sweaters a bit better. Uh, there we go. Excellent. A lovely green sweater. Very nice. Very festive. And who wouldn't want to be not Santa? Now, the next one we have is the fruitcake sweater, which is pretty simple. On the back and front, it just says fruit cake. So if you are a fan of fruitcake or are indeed a fruitcake yourself, you can enjoy this sweater. And it is, of course, the same green festive color as the previous one. Now we then have, oh, of course, actually, I was going to point this out on the uh, Santa sweater. You'll notice we have the slacks on. I have them in the various varieties. So we have the slacks with the Santa one. The uh, fruitcake one was with the jeans rather than slacks. So we look a bit more, I guess, uh, rustic. 
And then the next one we have is the Get Blitzed sweater in the sweater vest variety, as you can see here. So we're still wearing the slacks, a nice dress shirt, and we've got a couple of rad stags with some bottles of alcohol. Good times indeed, and with a lovely red color that matches the hat. And of course, let's get blitzed emblazoned right across there, and the same rad stags on the back with a little bit of snow. Very, very fun. I really do like these sweaters. I Again, I want them in real life. They'd be wonderful. Now the next one is the Jolly Rad Stag, which again I think is my favorite of all of them. As it's just, um, well, <laughs> you can probably use your imagination there. It's some Rad Stags having a wonderful time under what appears to be the North Star. <laughs> and it's just, uh, I don't, it's, it's the childishness in me. It makes me laugh. There we go. That is the Jolly Rad Stag sweater. We then have the Festive Mistletoe, which does say, Kiss me under the mistletoe with the mistletoes placed suspiciously low on the body. And, well, it has the same mistletoe on the back, but without the uh, kiss me text on the top. There we are. And, of course, a lovely festive red. A very, very fun indeed. And, finally, we have the festive tree sweater vest, which is just, you know, a, a Christmas tree in a vest. And there you are, your wonderful holiday sweaters in the three different varieties of sweater with pants, or well, slacks rather, sweater with jeans, and finally, sweater vest with slacks. And of course, our lovely Santa hat. And it's all wonderful. I really like this. I, I really, really do like this. It's, it's just a fun little mod with some silly little sweaters, a couple of which I admit I do want in real life because they're kind of hilarious. And yeah, just a fun, festive thing to have this lovely Christmas season. So if you would like to check these out for yourself, my friends, you can take a look at the link in the description as always. And uh, the mod maker may be adding in some additional sweaters. And since I'm actually pre-recording this before heading on my vacation. Uh, who knows, those additional sweaters may be here by now, so there may be a couple of more added in here that I'm currently missing, because at the moment, well, I've just got the six. But that is going to be it for this episode, folks. If you, uh, again, if you would like to check it out, link in description. Definitely have fun with it. Enjoy yourself. And I do hope you have enjoyed this uh, mod video today and that you do come back for the next when we'll be looking at yet another wonderful mod video. But um, until then, thank you for watching. And as always, have a good one.